Five minutes. Did you just break it? <laughs> Is it not safe? The wheel just fell off, so. Oh. We are back at it with another vlog for you guys. If you guys haven't seen our recent swing debacle, yes, we are kind of doing like this mini series, yes. showing you guys how we are assembling our baby stuff. Things like the baby swings that we were nice enough to get two gifted to us from our Amazon baby registry. So thank you guys for that. One of them was the Graco swing and another one is the Munchkin. The Munchkin has like a Bluetooth speaker but it's like really low to the ground, kind of portable. And then we have uh, this big mofo over here who is gigantic but it, it serves dual purposes and the dogs are playing around me. So... They only do this while recording, I don't know why. So let us try to keep continuing over our dog. Hey, can, can we record for like five minutes? Today's adventure is we are doing our stroller or travel system stroller. So we have the Chico Bravo LE 3-in-1 Quick Fold Trio Travel System. That was a mouthful. That's a lot. That is a lot. But this is a really good stroller and it's a lot. It's not the cheapest thing, but it's not the most expensive by far, but this does have a lot of features, a lot of benefits. We're gonna go over all of them in this video. And as well as showing me how to use how to this use stroller. She don't know. No, I really... I've never had a child and I know how to use it, but she don't. Whatever! I'm sorry, give me a minute. I just had to... Yes, they do play with each other. And as you guys can see, Orion knows how to play in a down position, like... Okay guys, we gotta record, so just give us one minute. So this stroller was actually a gift from my mom. She was hell-bent on getting us the stroller. Yeah, she was. And uh, so I was like, that's perfectly fine. So this stroller, again, three-in-one, you can do different systems. It does have the car seat for uh, newborns, which is very important because this is how you have to take your newborn home. So this is like a little base, a little car seat, and this clips into that as well. So this is kind of like a stroller that you use for several years and pretty much you don't really need another stroller besides this one. Uh, this stroller does have some features that I like because this is the new version of the Bravo LE. They did have an older one, which is a little bit cheaper. And the reason why I wanted to get this one was not just because it's the newer, it's because it has like one key feature that I think will make our lives a lot easier and loading it into the car to not take up as much space. Which is a big thing because imagine Janice is going to have to at some point take this by herself whenever she takes the baby out by herself. Suck the baby. Yep, so let's get into it guys. Let's uh, open it up. Let's see how much assembly is required. Hopefully not too much. It shouldn't be much, yeah. is out of the box and it smells like a brand new car <sighs> kind of does. i like the smell we're done oh, right. so believe okay paul so first impressions after unboxing it so far i like it there's a very minimal yeah we have one piece here that's like a little canopy which that does come off for certain things you want to do this i believe is the brake which is important i think Love it. <laughs> Make sure the little sushi don't roll away. And then we have that piece over there, and then this piece, which Orion is just obsessed with. Oh my good boy. So Paul's taking out the wheelies. It really does smell like a new car. Let me smell, let me smell again. Let me smell. Oh, that smells so delicious. I, I love new car smells. I know that sounds weird. Oh, yes. Oh. It just smells wealthy. See, I, I want to try to smell it again. Are we sure we want to use the stroller? Like, we got to keep the new car smell in. So, there's not much assembly required, but just enough. How are you feeling about it? So far, so good. Guys, Paul did so much research on this. I trust yeah. his judgment. We did get a lot of comments of people feeling like Paul shouldn't get much of a say when it comes down to choosing a stroller, which I found it a little astounding. Guys, this is a team effort. 
he had equal part in making this baby too. So we think. So I would definitely consider everything he says. And plus, when it comes down to this kind of stuff, he's super knowledgeable. So I trust that he knows what's best for me and him. And he's going to get something that complements the both of us. Did you just break it? <laughs> Is it not safe? The wheel just fell off, so... Oh. I completely missed a step. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, we can't be missing steps, Paul. Not with the stroller that's supposed to take our first child. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Paul has figured it out. And we have a wheel completely done. Let's hope this one does, doesn't come out now. No, th this one won't. <laughs> okay, that's good then. <laughs> Imagine us already starting to move it around. Oh, oh. oh my gosh, what's going on with our stroller? So these should be as simple as just pushing until it clicks. Wow, that was easy. Don't the dog hair out. Don't dirty my new car smelling stroller. There you go. Stroller is assembled. <laughs> oh, that was easy. Look at my stroller. Your mom's gonna be so proud when she sees it. Look at that. Look at that. Oh yeah. Now it's not done. No. There's still other stuff to do. But, oh really? Well, like what? Um, the canopy and then the little bar that goes across. Oh okay. It. And then we have this beauty. So this does adjust height. Up to like that, like literally okay. up right, but then if they you wanna go to sleep, <clears throat> shh, wind down. Fake night, night. Fake night, night. <laughs> if you guys don't know where that's from, it's from American Dad. Oh, we got cup holders, we have a bunch of stuff. So we'll go, I'll go over all the features and why I chose this one versus another one. So we're finished. We're getting there, guys. <laughs> now you're gonna add the canopy. Mm -hmm. Paul, you make everything look so easy. And I just have to like zip it up here, like attaching it to the other piece. Okay. So now we are moving to the car seat, right? That's the car seat? Yeah, this is the infant car infant. seat. Guys, once again, the overwhelming smell of new car is amazing. So before I actually move on to this, this is the last piece for this. This is the little snack tray. Ah, uh, got it. So you need this because this clicks onto this. Ah, okay, got it even more. Oh gosh, that smells delicious. You will see why this stroller is really nice because of what it does with this snack tray. So let's move on to this. Is it heavy? Not terribly. It's just this has the base for the car. Oh, uh, okay. So it, it is a little bulky and heavy right now. Once again, I don't know how single moms do it after labor. They have to carry these heavy things. Not, not just this, the baby too. And then, yeah, they have to go to the doctor's appointments. Like, women are strong, man. Does it work yet? It is. So how this works, for those of you who have never had a child, this goes strapped into your car. This goes into a seat, whatever it is, and there's like a specific way of how to route the seat belt and everything through here to secure it to the vehicle itself. Has like a little like level here to make sure it's at the appropriate level because wow. this is for a newborn. So this is for, I think, up to 30 pounds. They can be in this and this is obviously for when they are first born. When you take them home, you need to have this in your car with you because this is how you have to take them home. And if you don't have this, they don't let you take them home. Seriously. I wonder if parents like go deliver and forget about the car seat. I like, can imagine so, but at one okay. point probably in the hospital they're like, uh, yeah, you need it. I feel like, no, I feel like someone says they don't even check if you have it. But honestly, it would be nice if they could check because it would make a lot of parents feel a little bit more confident that this was installed correctly. Yes, the reason why we're doing this is because Janice is in her, well into her third trimester. And the baby can come at any time now, even though obviously, you know, we're not expecting, there's nothing saying that she's gonna go into labor right now, but. Babies kind of have a be, mind of their own. Exactly. They come kind of have to be prepared. At any moment. So we were told to have everything ready. You never know. We're getting all this done and prepared. If you were a first time parent, or if you've ever had kids, Definitely let us know when your baby came into this world. How young were they? How many weeks? Let us know. We would love to know. So this is the infant carrier. This is it for the newborn. So it has all the inserts and all these things. This can come out if you need, you know, once I get a little bit bigger. And it has a little harness and everything here. Now, this is the key fit 
30. There are different versions of the Chico. They have the key fit like 35, you know, different models. And, you know, this stroller was still reasonably priced, like under $500. Some of their strollers go for $800, $900. So those have different features. They have all sorts of different things like that. And those just, again, go with the price. But this one was a really good bang for your buck. Again, this is not the cheapest one, but this is kind of like a, I say like a mid-level yeah. stroller. It has lots of features, and again, I think this one's awesome. Baby carrier goes in here like so. It clicks. Hey. Hey. And then you can fold this out of the way so you can see said child. So getting into some of the features of this stroller. This stroller has adjustable handlebars here. Oh yeah, Paul so, like that. If you, for a shorter or you just want a lower grip, you can do this. It has built-in two cup holders and like a little pouch here, which will be snacks for Orion. Another cool thing is that if you're out and you have the shade over, you do have a little mesh right here so you can see said baby and give them a little bit of ventilation as well. So if it's raining, really sunny, hot out, so on and so forth. This one also has the same thing. When you lean it over here, there's actually this little zipper that you see right here. And more ventilation. Ta-da! So again, if you're out on a hot day, you can open it up here, open it up there. The baby can get some airflow while you're walking in and about. This is a feature that not all of these like stroller combination travel systems had. When I saw this, I was like, in Florida, it being really, really hot, I do not want the baby to overheat. I thought that was kind of a little bit of a smart, yeah, simple smart detail of that's awesome. You know what I mean? Pull this up. You have the button here, here, and out. Cool thing about this one is again, some canopies only go out to here. This one goes out a little further, and it has an additional shade here as well. Oh my goodness! So a again, vampire for summer. The heat, the sun, you have these options. You don't have to pull it all the way out. You can literally just do half, you can do this, yeah. whatever. So that's what I loved about this one, that it had a lot of canopy options for you because most of them just do that. Yeah. And then they have, some of them have this additional and this one has even more. Yeah. So Even I on a love. rainy day, it will definitely protect the baby because also here in Florida, it rains. Every single day in summer. Yeah. So between this one and this one, you cover it. The baby's completely, all of this material here is waterproof. So that's another feature that I genuinely liked about the stroller. Now lastly, is how you close it. Very simple, with one hand you can do it. So in here, underneath the seat, is the handle. So you're gonna have to grab this handle, push, and then with one hand, it completely Ta -da! And it stands on its own as well. Yeah, that's actually pretty cool. So notice, the snack tray, how it folded in with it here. S most of these, the older one, this big tray will be like sticking out all the way up here. So then again, when you put this into your car, it takes up more space. <laughs> yeah. So then just to unfold it, you grab the handle and that's it. Another thing is this little padding here is reversible. So it has like this like very fluffy side for winter to keep them warm. And then this mesh side to keep them cool in the summer. So that's yes. actually a really nice little detail. Now remember guys, we are having this baby in August. I, my pregnancy was through the heat of the Floridian summer. But when the baby's here, she's going to be dealing with the cold. So we got to get her all snugged up and ready. That comes into another piece. So this actually snaps on to where the baby goes and i'll show you how again i've never really done this but i've seen lots of videos so this goes here snaps mm, snap on, it in. and snaps on and there you go Ta -da! so the baby's right there you put a nice little blanket on right here but this is going to help insulate them a little bit more yeah keep them both waterproof and in the winter nice and warm and toasty and this is another feature that the the more entry level stroller did not have and i was like when we have this baby and newborn is going to be in the heat and then in a few short months it is going to get cold here in florida so i was like i love it i'm down for it this will be perfect and again simple things like this make our life easier more than happy to get it we did get this stroller from bye bye baby they did have a 20 percent off your entire order when we first ordered something online so we definitely used that 20% yes. off 
and it went through. So this came out to be, even though this is the more expensive version, this came out to be the same price, I think even like $15 cheaper than the next version down below. Yeah, this one. we got like $100 off, thankfully. So it was over 100 bucks off that we got off of it, and free shipping as well. So when I saw that deal, my mom was getting it, I was like, this is the one, without a doubt. The handle here is like a thick, thick rubber. Yeah. Um, some of them come with like a foam. Yeah. And the one complaint was people said like, after a while, the foam starts falling apart and the higher end ones have this like rubber. And if you get really high end, they have leather. <laughs> yeah. So Janice is here now. She's I, gonna start playing. I, I get hit a lot with a baby, she kicks. I know a lot of you guys wanna see the belly, so now it's my turn to mess with this a little. Let's see. Woo, okay. You got this, babe. Got it. it has to face you. Yeah, I know. Got it, like got if you're it. pushing the stroller, it faces you. I don't know any of this. No, okay. you're fine, babe. Okay, I gotta pretend the baby's in here because I don't wanna be like moving it around. I'm like, what? There you go. This is That's exhausting. It. Yeah. Oh, Perfect. I got an easy click. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah. So I'm thinking it's gonna be hard. So then lower this by pushing the two tabs on the side, both at the same time. And then just push. There I you go. To get less and this goes all the way down there until it clicks. I don't want nobody looking at my baby. No one's allowed to see her and her glorious beauty. Time for me to close it so up. So you gotta push this up, right? Yep, perfect. There you go. Oh, you have the button back there. I was getting it's, there. It's it's kind of stiff. You have to like really pull it, like real. Can we more. oil it? Eh, there you oh, go. I got it. Well, that was it's just bad. it's just new. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Okay. Woo. Okay, so now it is time to lift this up. Okay, there we go. Pull this up and... You have to push the button at the same time, I what think. What button? The orange button. Both? Oh, like that? Yes. Oh, I thought you needed two fingers to do that. Okay, ready? I just don't want to clip my toesies. You're fine. You gotta push the button at the same time, babe. That's what I'm doing! Okay, that's not going. So I'm not the only one who failed. You know, it, it is it, brand it's, new, it's stiff. That's, it, that's what it is, it's new, so it's a little stiff. So you yeah. go like that, and you kind of just like, Jolt it up. Like that, like it's. Okay, I'll try again. weird how it's doing that. All right, just try, it, it's, it's just new. I gotta do this again. Oh, just this little right now, has her kicking a lot, my bladder, and it hurts. There you it. go. Woo. I didn't want to clip my feet. I did it. I did it all right. I did and it. again, you know, it stands on its own, so it'll make it a little bit easier and to. You said to bring it back up. Yeah, just bring it up and snap. snap. I heard a snap. I think. Is it? There you oh. go. Just a little okay, bit so more. So maybe like push. Yeah, but that you don't. You don't got. That's not the point where you're like. Rah! Like that's just okay. help a little bit, so you know if it's in or not. Okay, so I want to try it again because practice makes better. Oh, okay, okay. That's, yeah, it's that just a lot easier. It's just new. It's getting there. And then you open it up. Perfect. <laughs> Even more, no one's allowed to look at her. No one's allowed to look at her. Pull it. There you go. Perfect. No one's allowed to look at her. I'm doing it. I'm becoming a mother. How is this possible? Why is it that the stroller is like three-fourths your size? Does that make me look like a child? Kind of. Pushing around a baby, a toy baby, now. Ah! Now, you guys saw that I put the canopy on. So you can take the canopy off, obviously, and then this whole entire seat back right here all of this comes out to just leave the bare frame and you just put this clipped in here so i would do that but that seems like a lot of work that i do not want to do right now would you do it when the baby's here maybe like when they're a newborn just to make it a little bit easier but yeah. at the same time it's kind of like it just depends on that's like a personal preference thing but all of it comes out to just leave like literally just the bare frame okay and that got it that's personal preference but then you don't get the extra canopy over them too. got it so yeah it's yeah like a pro and con you know what i mean yeah i like the extra canopy you know yeah summer heat wind S snow sun look at all the things that we think of Alrighty guys, so I think this is where we end it. We showed you guys what our setup was and once again, these videos are to help educate other parents, other parents-to-be and show that you're not alone in this journey. Some of these things are um, yeah. a, little a, little, a little tricky, a little nerve-wracking and we could get through it together. Now remember guys, this is the Chico Bravo LE. There is the Chico Bravo Trio, which is the one level down from this one. So 
So it doesn't have certain things like the folding tray, the extra canopy, the little thing here. So there's just like a few little odds and ends there. I hope we were able to, you know, kind of educate you a little bit. And uh, if you guys are parents to be, you know, a little bit of insight. Definitely tell us what tricks helped you and what you went with. Of course, once again, we had to go with the Chico. There's different other baby brands out there. <laughs> a lot. It's really overwhelming. A lot. And once again, if you guys seen our macro baby vlog, there, there's even strollers that go over a thousand. Over, well over a thousand. Like I can't even say it because it's, it's designer. Yeah, with leather and all that, which is beautiful, but it's for a baby. They're gonna throw up pee poop in this. Who cares? Yeah, honestly, that's one one advice for us to give you guys. If you have the money, go for it. If you want to go crazy, splurge definitely. But it's not worth it. Something like this is perfect because it's good quality, it's decent, it'll last you through the years, but I'm not gonna be like, oh, I got a dirty, I'm pissed. Yeah. Alrighty, guys, so this is where we end it. We are gonna take it chill. We're exhausted from all these things that we have assembled, but we're excited. This really brings us together when we are doing projects like this. Yeah, it's fun. While Paul is creating things, I'm also creating things. Ha! Organs. Yes and fingers and nails oh my do not forget to like share and subscribe it helps us with our journey it helps us spread awareness and it helps us educate others too that you are not alone in any of this also do not forget to check out our other social media platforms such as instagram and patreon instagram of course you guys could check out orion's service dog journey since he was a wee little pup up till today patreon guys is an exclusive platform that we give behind the scenes content on us, the Raw Life family, and we even offer one-on-one -on -one Skype sessions with us to talk about training, life, chronic illnesses, or just to talk. Check it out, guys, if you are interested. Do not forget to also check out our baby registry. Guys, we have already done our baby shower live, but it doesn't mean the fun gets to stop. We're still sending out thank you cards. We're sending out exclusive merch that I think you guys are going to love. So guys, this is where we end it. We are going to chill, take it easy. Yeah, it is nighttime. We are exhausted from all these baby preparations. Time is coming closer and closer and we're so excited. So guys, for now, adieu and good night.